Hey guys, Darren at Green Pro Cleaning Limited, Window Cleaning in Nottingham Derby. Um, today's topic, I'm talking about flow rate. And by flow rate, what I mean is one of the questions that got asked a lot when I was starting out was how much water do you need to rinse off the grass successfully? And uh, there was a lot of various theories bandied about, but one of the answers uh, was given to me by a chap from Cornwall, uh, Richard. And Richard was uh, a geek, a 100% cleaning geek. He knew the science of the chemicals, he knew the science of the water. He, he studied long and hard and he knew his shit inside now. And he came up with an answer that the uh, appropriate amount of water to rinse a window properly so as not to leave any spotting after it's been cleaned is two litres a minute. Now, in these old pound buckets from uh, B&Q, two litres is uh, just about here. There's actually a measure on the inside. I keep forgetting which I ground one's up there getting sunny out so now I can't see the bloody thing there so oh there it is over that side of the handle so yeah so two litres is just about just about here so the only way to test it is to get yourself a bucket with a measure on it or some other way to measure two litres get your brush your, your go-to in my case my go-to brush is uh, my flock brush from gardens at the moment loving this brush um, and my go-to jets are pencil jets I just find them so much quicker these days on my maintenance cleans but uh, anyhow that's my go-to setup so I've got my controller set to where I normally set it, and the only way to do this, get the old stopwatch, here we go, and it's just coming up to 25, uh, 25 seconds past, so into the bucket, and once that hits the two litres, we're going to keep uh, keep watching, I'm doing this in real time, so it may be a bit boring for you guys, so I'll try and talk a little bit, but uh, that's going into there now, and uh, already, we're up to about a litre in there, let me just find the, uh, the measuring side again. Um, there's a two litre mark over there. I can't see that clearly now and I've got the bucket. Always make sure your bucket's level. So uh, coming up to 30 seconds. And I'm going to say, I, I'm doing this as a, um, as a straight off the bat test of how my system's set. I haven't even measured this previously to doing this. So if I'm even in the region, it's going to be pure bloody fluke. Um, uh, still coming up now, getting closer to two litres. And we're coming up to, that's uh, 50 seconds, 55 seconds rather. And so now we are, bang on, we're just on the minute mark there. And I'll shit you not, if I could show you inside here, which I could if I dismount the camera except for the fuck of that. But if I could show you inside here, that is, uh, that's going to be about 1.8 litres. So, and uh, I'll try and show you that there, just so you know I'm not talking shit. <laughs> I'm, I'm not that skilled but pull that off uh, that easy but uh, where's the measures gone again uh, always losing the bloody things there we go down on that side there let me try and get some sunlight on it so you can see Oop. get that back on the flat that there is the uh, da -da -da -da. where's it gone six litre four litre two litre mark just there so I'm at about 1.8 litres hope you can see that clearly down in there guys don't know if you can or not but what the hell and that's the appropriate amount of water to be able to clean a window successfully, to rinse off successfully. Other factors you've got to take in mind. Your pump. How old is your pump? Is it operating at its optimum? Is it doing what it can do? This is a 5.1 litre a minute pump. Um, so, through its outlet, which is uh, half inch there, it should be able to pump 5.5 litres. But then mine goes through the heating system. Then it comes down here through, uh, through my 6 mil hose system. So then it goes down into the orange pole hose, so everything, flow restriction, etc. all this has to be calculated. So for me, around two litres a minute, just under, is 65 on my controller. And, uh, and that's really how to work it out. Simply put your, uh, put your jets in a bucket or your fans or whatever you prefer, um, turn them on and see how long it takes to fill up. But uh, anyway, hope you found something useful, something interesting in this video. Any comments, guys, please bang them in the box below. Um, if you like what we do, please subscribe. Thanks for watching. Have a great weekend. Talk to you all soon.